We have a major warm up coming our way starting tomorrow. Tomorrow actually begins our warming trend. We're back to sunshine for the weekend and the snow. If you have any left, it will be clear by tonight for sure. Let's take a look at our satellite and radar. Most of the snow has cleared. Still a little bit heavier in the southern part of the state. Still cloudy with some light snow in parts of the high country. As we zoom on in to the Denver area, breaking up a bit more for us. It's just cloudy outside the CBS4 studio now. But north side of town, we're getting a little bit of rain and then heading down towards Littleton. There's still a little bit of light to moderate snowfall. So we still have something left out there, but there's not much to go. And as we head down to the south a bit more, this is where you're going to find some of the heavier snowfall just south of Pueblo into Walstenburg and for some of our Sangre de Cristo and white uh, wet mountain areas. So that's where we continue to have winter weather alerts, winter storm warnings, winter weather advisories through 11 o'clock tonight. So if perhaps you're traveling along I-7 or I-25 towards southern Colorado, just know that for the next couple of hours, there will be some moderate to heavy snowfall. Our weather watcher Lori Finch reporting two and a half inches of snow in Foxfield for us this at, this morning, uh, early afternoon now, I guess, and taking a look at our future cast, we will continue to see some light snow in the mountain areas. Really, again, most everything should be wrapped up by about 6, 7 o'clock tonight, even in the southern part of the state. And then we clear out from everything overnight into Saturday morning. It's not crazy cold out there on Saturday morning. It's a little chilly if you're going skiing or live up in the high country. And then Saturday, mostly sunny conditions. It's a beautiful day uh, with lots of sunshine. So again, if you're going skiing to enjoy the little bit of fresh powder that we have, it should be really nice out there. Front Range Eastern Plains, a lot of melting if we had any snow still left out there. Right now we're sitting at 40 in Denver, 43 in uh, Boulder, and 44 in Fort Collins. 40s, 50s out in the Eastern Plains, 20s, 30s in the high country. And we should stay in the low 40s and 50s for the Front Range and Eastern Plains today. 42 in Denver, 46 in Boulder, lots of 20s and upper thir or low 30s in the high country, and then 30s to the 50s off to the west. Across the Front Range, 46 in Brighton and Firestone, 43 in Broomfield in Denver, also in Lakewood and Centennial and Littleton. And as we zoom on into Adams County, a lot of 46s out there. 46 in Commerce City, Henderson, Thornton, East Lake, and then 43 in Federal Heights. Now for our super seven day forecast, temperatures on Saturday jumped to 50 degrees. Again, that is the beginning of our warming trend. And then on Sunday, 57 degrees around here. It's going to be so warm. Uh, we're looking at temperatures in the 50 uh, upper 50s, close to the 60s for all of the Front Range and Eastern Plains. And then in the high country, lots of 40s. So very, very warm in our mountain areas as well. And then we could see some 60s by Tuesday around here. So warm and dry is the name of the game after we get past today. So it will be feeling a little bit more like spring than early February. I know I shouldn't be excited for warmth this early in the year. Yes. It's nice, but it is not where we should be. No. Yes. But I'm thrilled. Yes. Yes. <laughs> All right, Lauren, thank you.